Kelly Clarkson accuses ex-husband Brandon Blackstock of stealing. Kelly Clarkson has, allegedly, accused her ex-husband, Brandon Blackstock of stealing from her. In its December 28 issue, In Touch Weekly claimed that Clarkson is livid at her ex-husband after he and his dad urged her to pay millions. A source told the tabloid that Clarkson's kid gloves are finally off, and she's ready to fight back. She's livid and it never occurred to her that Brandon could stoop so low, the source said. The insider also said that Clarkson is furious over Blackstock's request to receive $5 million a year in spousal support after he wasn't granted custody of their kids. According to the source, the American Idol winner takes responsibility for the role that she played in the breakdown of her marriage. However, Clarkson has no plans to just sit back and get ripped off by Blackstock. The tabloid claimed that the exes now have an all-out war, and Clarkson will most likely win in the end. Clarkson rarely talks about her divorce because she wants to protect the feelings of her two kids. But on a rare occasion, she revealed that one of Garth Brooks' songs helped her amid her divorce. Shortly after, Brooks reacted to Clarkson's comment by telling Entertainment Tonight that he's happy his music helped his fellow artist. During an episode of The Kelly Clarkson Show, the singer admitted that she has been feeling shame and guilt for her marriage ending. Clarkson said that there are times when she couldn't grasp what she's feeling. But when she stumbled upon one of Brooks' songs, she finally understood what was going through her head. The singer also revealed that Brooks' song inspired her to write one track from her album. Meanwhile, Clarkson was granted primary custody of her kids this month. But according to Billboard, Clarkson and Blackstock will share joint physical and legal custody of their kids. But River Rose and Remington will be living with Clarkson in Los Angeles. The court also granted Blackstock with ample time to spend with his kids which includes daily face time, set visitations, custody on weekends, and on school breaks. According to the documents, Clarkson and Blackstock cannot speak in a derogatory manner about each other when they are with their kids. And the custodial parent shouldn't also allow their kids to be around someone who is speaking negatively about the other parent in a derogatory manner. River Rose and Remington cannot also be driven by their parents if they have consumed alcohol within eight hours. 